Welcome back mayors, my name is Tokreva and this is some more City Skylines playing Los Horus and we're back in our small um, floodplains area it's yeah it's basically the floodplains that we dried out and we have started getting some buildings going here and I gave it a building theme um, because I was like yeah I want to check this out so this um, well the city has international housing this for now called Strawberry Park will have finished type houses so it only has these these style buildings basically are gonna pop up here and quite a few of them as well um, what I should get though at the entrance here oh we actually have a oh I see ah with the unlocking of the European buildings I actually have all the European stuff unlocked as well that's pretty cool so we're gonna have a European style firehouse over here because apparently this is it has even got an Italian flag for some reason so does it have mean we have different types of hospitals too yeah we have a European style hospital and a medical clinic we have European style um, police stations. Yeah, this is a European style police station. It's also going to be placed somewhere around here. Like right there. Hmm. Now that, yeah, the unlocker actually unlocks everything. So we have European style universities too. Oh man, that actually, that thing, is that bigger? It actually is bigger than the regular university as well. We will need schooling over here, that's much as true too. It'll get power in a second, don't worry about it. Actually, if I remove that one, it still has power everywhere here. So this is a more European style neighborhood. Let's add a couple more housing areas here. And this area too. Screw it. I might add one more connection somewhere over here. Um, actually, I will. There we go, another connection into the neighborhood, basically. So we are gonna need some shops, and what better place than to do that on the other side of the road here. So we'll have some low density shops going from there till there. And let's just make these go to the other side. So we can have more sh Seriously, I made it one too short? Okay. Apparently I made it a little bit too short here. Because it's... Because you check on the avenue. Yeah, and the avenue already has one extra tile of road it needs to consider. So when you go from the avenue... This is one less tile available because the avenue is one wider than the, uh, the rest of the area. I'll add all of this to. Up here seems like a reasonable place for an office park. Maybe. But at least have some shops near the... Uh, Near the new neighborhood, I guess. Um, no, no, here is going to be offices. Uh -huh, let's go from here.
There we go, new area for offices. Um, it will get power from Barlow Heights. I just need to give it some more water. I will connect it there as well. Something like this, it seems to work. And just for the sake of completing the lines, let's also add this all to it. Perfect. Really weird, but perfect. Perfect fit. We need more offices, we need more shops as well, which is kind of weird. I mean, let's look at population for a second. We have... Not many more jobs available than there are people, so we do have some unemployment going on. Okay. That is indeed interesting to know. Um, actually, different types of roads are required here. A gravel road. Because let's face it, these are floodplains and they are very, very fertile. So we are going to have a couple of... Uh, farms going around here. Something like this. So this, um, probably until here, summer will be mostly farms. Not all of it. Oh wow, it actually gets an automatic curve too. I do want multiple road accesses here. And I want to have a bigger road that goes into the mountain. Probably out somewhere over here. Just to connect it. Oh wow, we have some traffic backing up. Because, yeah. They all want to go into the city from here. And this is not allowing it to happen. It's backed up very freaking far. Holy crap. I need to bring this back down to a regular area. Without bus lanes. All of this. And this and this and this. There we go, it's already changing into two-lane traffic, which is good. Which is what it should do. All seems fine. There are a lot of traffic going straight on, or what is the deal here? Seriously, why are you all still trying to get on the same lane here? Ah, oh, these people. Good, our office park is growing here. So we just need commercial right now. And hey, we have a lot of room for commercial back here. Mm, not around the hospital itself, but... Something like this, and then this. That should fit the bill. Oh, look at this. Yeah, this is just a really weird patch of um, unintended area, I guess.
There you go. few more houses if able to build there how's our area looking down here actually pretty good I love the amount of trees that these houses have holy crap so many trees makes it look pretty cool and there's still enough room to expand this particular neighborhood slightly <laughs> This goes here. This goes somewhere like there. Orchard Heights, it's actually a really decent name for a uh, agricultural area. There we go. Um, what is it? Is that Parks and Rec? Yeah, Parks and Rec is already available here. Well, now we just need to zone this um, industrially to get our first farmlands going. I wonder if there's actually any difference between European style and international style farms. At least in the game, I mean, it's definitely different in real life, but... There we go. Now let it expand. It has a couple of... Yeah, Strawberry Park is going to be filled with uh, cars and such now. Ooh, wow, that looks... The real surreal. The real cereal, yeah. You can pronounce it as the real surreal. It doesn't work. It's not how it's supposed to be, but you can do it. I want this tile badly right now. I wonder, are people actually coming off the highway over here at all I don't think so doesn't appear to be the case mm. uh, I'll just take a drink right now while we check for um, cars and yeah, a lot of traffic yet sadly and the University District really is getting some high rise, and it's cool. Um, whoa, six, almost seventeen hundred students in the university itself. This is a very much more um, international slash American campus, because many universities in Europe, Europe are old, and that means that they started like closer to the cities and the cities grew around the universities and then when the universities tried to expand they couldn't get anywhere so they were kind of forced to grow kind of different ways at all um let's see hang on a minute yes i want my metro line to go through the valley so okay that's trains i need metro stations We're going to have to remove some buildings. I mean, that's going to be a given. People won't like that the metro stations are going to be here. One is going there. They don't have to like it, though. They just have to live with it. It's too... Definitely need one in the office park area. Like 
like right here on the corner. And now for the best part. Oh god, destroying one of the high rises. Actually, this one feels like it can be removed. Just going straight this way. No two by three buildings or something like that. Two by hello, that's a two by, but that would make a really really weird corner as well. Mm, there are bus lines connecting this area, so that's not to worry. Uh, build it there and connect it by pathway across here and just dezone this little bit yeah that allows us to have more people going here uh, let's connect the Metro lines themselves. And one that goes up to there. Oh. Okay, that's going to be annoying because there are a couple of train rails going through here. Slope too steep. Maybe we can go this way. What if we go down a bit? No, it tries to go really weird. Because it's trying to do some really weird stuff. Okay, now it's crossing the train rails. Now this is going to be the hard part, getting by the train rails over here. <laughs> Seriously, slope too steep still. I think that train rail track is really deep. Hang on. That's a good start. Yes, we have crossed the uncrossable area. Actually, this leaves room for one more station over here, which is perfect. Build it here. Uh, you are gonna have some serious issues with the bus lanes. Holy crap. Um, yeah, this is gonna have to do it like this then. Gonna have to go around the walk path of the bus. Oh, that was too fast. Really slope too steep for that. Fine. I'll start the slope on this side then. They walk through the middle, all of them anyway, so...
There we go, perfect. Destroyed just the right bit that needed to be destroyed and removed. And you can connect back here. And we have ourselves a complete tunnel that goes really wonky at places, but still it works. Create a new line. One stop. Two, three, four, five, six, and back to five, four, three, two, one, and complete the line. Uh, let's see, line three. Yeah, line one is doing really well, the green line. I should add another station to that line as well. Like over here-ish. That really, really wonky bit. Move to stop here and then re-add stops to the line here. Are you all going to walk where? Oh god, I'm going to follow these guys because this is this might become hilarious. If Are they all going to walk to the other side? Um, oh no, they're going to wait for the bus instead. Well, that's possible too. Regardless, I want to thank you all for watching. Make sure to like this video if you enjoyed it and subscribe to the channel if you want to keep up to date in the future. I will see you guys later.